Wrong button. <laughs> All right, let's see if we got this. Yeah, metal here. All right, all right, all right. And hey, look, there's metal here as well. Metal here. Wait, wait, wait. <gasps> and we have a turtle. We have a turtle back on top of our rock. Oh, dude, you're amazing. You know, I may actually have to just tame you just because what level? You're level 20? And you're out. <laughs> I'm gonna throw some berries on you and you're gonna be my buddy and you're gonna be uh, the head of Turtle Rock. That's right. Okay, and you will be Turtle Rock's rock because you're the rock that holds the rock together, right? All right, all right. Yeah, I think that makes sense. That makes absolute perfect sense, doesn't it? Actually, I don't think that makes any sense, but you know what? I'm going with it. Hey, how's it going, everybody? Welcome back to Lost Isles. I'm Flicker Foo, and holy crap, it has been a minute since I've been, uh, since I've even played Ark. Oh my gosh. Uh, yeah, because anybody, uh, anybody watching this, you know, like a year, two years down the road, they'll be like, what? It's just from one episode to the next. But everybody who's watching it, you know, as the videos come out, they'll be like, yeah, it's been a minute because it's been uh i was three weeks since i actually uh loaded up arc in any fashion i recorded a whole bunch i went on vacation and all the videos that came out while i was on vacation were the videos that i had recorded up in like a two weeks time i literally spent two weeks where I, all i did is eat sleep and uh, play Ark, and that's all I did for like two weeks getting up for, ready for my vacation, but I'm back, so yeah, I'm back, yeah, all right, so, I mean, I, I did really love vacation, though, I mean, so it is a shame that vacation is over, but, you know, it is what it is, and we're back to um, doing all this because I love this game, and this is amazing, and oh my gosh, woohoo, all right, so, <laughs> let's see, so uh, we've got metal confirmed. All right, we've got uh, Rock of the Rock for the rock up there that is being tamed. Do you have measure berries on you? Give me one sec and you will have measure berries on you. <laughs> but yeah, um, today uh, I am going to be uh, probably setting up a few things, getting ready for breeding and kibble farms and stuff because that's what I need to do. Um, so uh, yeah, let's see. Let's get up here, get this going. And uh, we need to get that metal farmed up because we need to uh, start getting some uh, metal smelted so where we can craft wreck saddles because I wasn't even paying attention to when I could craft wreck saddles and that's level 74. So Rex right there, bam, nailed it, level 74. It was so good, my Sino Macrops pooped down my back. It was amazing, all right? And we're not yet close to UD, which is kind of unfortunate, but that's the thing. Um, although we are uh, close to, say, like, I mean, Mining Laser and Beauty uh, get unlocked at level 80, which is kind of, uh, it, it's kind of important, you know? Well, Mining Laser, not as much. Everything else is kind of cool. Are you gonna tame up just fine? Fine. Yeah? Oh, yeah, you'll be fine. You'll be fine. All right, let's get down here. Base plan against a couple trees. Where did I put you? I put you over here. All right. Put these berries back on you. Put those berries back on you. Uh, oh, yeah, that's right. Uh, before I left, I used up all of your spoiled meat. Oh, my gosh. That's a thing. And it's a shame I'm loading up my unicorn with weight. That is a real shame. All right. Uh, but, yeah. Okay, but yeah, what I was uh, talking about here just earlier before I rudely interrupted myself with my own comments. Um, yeah, I'm thinking about um, setting up an area just for breeding, just for um, doing all sorts of stuff. Uh, we need to get... I mean, we honestly... I mean, we have a Uteranus. And it's a pretty decent one. It's not the best. Let's see, get back over here. Oh, no, don't make me swim. Don't make me swim. I don't know why I'm saying that. I can always just glide. All right, so, yeah. Uh, so we have a Uteranus that is, I mean, it's decent. It's got a decent health stat. It's got a crappy uh, melee stat. It's got really good stamina. So it's a good boss dino. Um, or it's a good boss breeder. So we'll probably need to go out and get another Uteranus 
just where we can breed with that one. Uh, we've got a Rex right here that's got 301 melee damage, 8140 um, health. Not the best, not the worst. All right, this one right here. This is 9460. Better. Much, much better health. Much, much better uh, melee stat. And that is my mail right here. So we are going to just title you options, change name. Breeder dude. There you go, breeder dude. Dude, you are one lucky dude. I'm just saying. All right. Um, and then right here, we got 8140. Not as good. All right. Are you male or female right here? You are female. Okay. So, um, yeah, this one right here next to breeder dude. Not as good. All right. So let's see. What about this one right here? All right, 79, 313. This is probably the one I'm going to breed him with. All right, because uh, she has a higher uh, melee stat. Although we need to, I need to really uh, concentrate on. All right, we need to concentrate on. Um... Well, hold on, let me see. What is your stamina? Before I commit, 1890 stamina, 840 weight. Okay, yeah, that's good. Okay, yeah, so we're going to uh, try to get her stamina stat and uh, um, his melee and health stat all stacked, which is kind of cool. Um, we're already on the way to do that. Also, I may get sidetracked because there's uh, some things I've been just dying to do um, since uh, I got on here, and I've been dying to actually get more than just one monkey because I've got food pithecus, and food pithecus is awesome, but I would love to do a breeding project for uh, dino pithecus because I haven't done that yet. I realize everybody under the sun's done that yet. Um, you probably at home have um, done that, and you probably at home have got just like the most amazing ones, and I'm sitting here with just. Yeah. Uh, but I do have a green and black thyla, so ha 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 ha. All right, so yeah, that's a thing. But yeah, uh, what I was going to do is I was going to go mine some metal really quick, and then I'm going to uh, come back and tell you guys what I was going to do with that section over there as designated by the handy dandy laser pointer. All right, so hey, I'm going to do that, and I will see you guys in just a bit. Oh my gosh, he's awake. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, you... Yeah, smack. Thank you. All right, smack smack again. Find another one down there and then smack it again. I realize there's none more down there, but you know what? Just make believe ones there, all right? Smack it again because we are dealing with this guy up here, which happens to be... Hold on. You are awake, so you are the rock of the rock for the rock. And this isn't all going to fit. Let's see what all fits. The Rock of the Rock. You know what? Let's just rename it. Since that's what's going to fit, we will go The Rock of the Rock. Nailed it. Oh, dude. You are such a rock up here on the rock. And yeah, dude, guard the island. Thank you. You're amazing. All right. We will have to, like, paint him or something. Do, you know, do something special for him. You know, maybe for his birthday. All right, uh, so <laughs> let's get down here. Let's go see. Uh, oh, hold on. Yeah, I was harvesting up metal before I got sidetracked by naming things rocks. And yeah. You're not going to spend. Oh, there you go. Ha, 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 ha. All right. Let me finish this and I'll bring you guys back again. All right, so let's get over here. Uh, it's metal. Uh, do we have enough stuff to actually craft the things that we want to craft? Uh, let's see, saddle. You were a wreck saddle. Which one would you... You would be that one. All right, we need more fiber. Okay, so... Right here. Do this. Thank you. All right, so uh, yeah, wreck saddles. We will get it. Sure, we'll just put those in there because yeah, apparently rare flowers don't belong in there. But you know what they do today? Really? Okay, we need a bunch more height.
Well, that's not gonna do it. Blue, do you have any hide on you? No. All right, so uh, we've got enough for two saddles because I don't want to go out, out and uh, harvest a whole bunch of uh, creatures right now. So we've got two saddles. Bam, and come on, gimme, 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 gimme. Also, gimme XP. I could use some XP. Close. Very close to 80. All right, and then we can get Uteranus saddle. And I can't believe I'm actually thinking about already starting to do bosses before even level 80. Wow. All right. Okay, so uh, now that we've got these, uh, I'm gonna take, let's take over Breeder, uh, not Dude. Uh, put her right here. All right, let's see. Now I want to uh, breed them over in an area that is kind of isolated from everything. Um, I could breed them right next to the base, but you know what? I, I, I think I want an area over here. It means we could take the eggs over there, we could hatch them, but I just, you know, maybe I'll just raise them up over there. No, no, because we're going to need to have some sort of a thing over here. It may create a little bit more work for me, but it's going to be so much more organized. Oh, my gosh. That's one of the things I hate is, you know, you're doing up a breeding project. And then next thing you know, it's like your entire base is filled up with just dinos of that type. Come on. Yeah, you're going down, dude. All right, just deal with it. All right, this has already been declared. Come on. Want to charge at me? I don't think so. Oh, that was a 135 trike. Oh, okay. Nobody saw that. All right, so we're just going to load you up right here in the beginning, right here in the front. Right there, next to the other rocks that aren't nearly as special as the other rocks, because the other rocks, the other rock is up on top of the rock, and which makes him the head rock. All right. All right, so let's go get the other one, and then we'll drag that over there. Also, I'm going to grab the other, oh, I probably should have grabbed that saddle. Actually, you know what? I can just have him follow me. <laughs> That's so crazy, it just might work. Let's see if this uh, works. Don't you just love it when a crazy idea works? Not crystal in there, is it? Oh, it just looks like coral. All right, so uh, let's pop these guys over here. Uh, these two right here can go way over in the corner because I don't need them. At least I don't think I do. All right, there you go. Snip the butt, and then I'm leaving you there. All right. I'm gonna pop this one over here. Now I want to see what kind of sample size, what kind of a sample we get off of a first egg. I'm probably not going to commit to the first one. But, uh, back, uh, behavior, full mating, behavior, enable mating. All right, let's see what kind of an egg we can get from these two. It's going to take a minute, uh, maybe a couple minutes, but a minute is my unit of reference that means that it's going to take a unit of time. Yes, so it, a minute can be a month, a minute can be a week, a minute can be a year, uh, a minute can be a minute, oddly enough. But yeah, this is going to take me a minute. All right, I'll see you guys in a minute. Thank you, Mr. Ichthyornis, for coming close to the base and giving me hide so where I can, uh, or hide and meat so where I can feed it to my newfound baby Rexes that are about to be born. Thank you. But yeah, I uh, decided to grab two eggs and this should be perfect. All right. All right, so as these eggs are starting to come up, uh, yeah. So, uh, yeah, uh, anybody wondering, vacation was great. Vacation was amazing, honestly. Uh, yeah, what I did, I uh, went up to Seattle. I flew out. Uh, uh, had a really good flight over to uh, London. Uh, it's a long flight, like nine hours. <laughs> and, I mean, that's a long flight. And then from there, I went up to Glasgow, Scotland. Oh, man, it was so great. Um are you ready to come up? 20 seconds, uh, 13 seconds. Okay. And then um, uh, from there, I went up to, uh, 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 let's see, I went from the Glasgow airport uh, up to uh, just probably about 40, 40 miles away. Holy. All right. So we've got some Rexes. All right. Let's see this one there. Uh, one there. And 223, you are probably not going to be the one I keep. Let's take your stats first. 
All right, so we got uh, the lower stamina, we got the high health, uh, we got the lower melee damage. So, uh, let's see, no mutations, you're probably not gonna be sticking around. All right, what about you and your twins? I think you got higher food and oxygen. No, just higher food. All right, so you got all the same stats. Uh, we didn't get the one we're looking for. Uh, these guys are probably not going to be sticking around. Um, yeah, these are not uh, the breeders I've been looking for. Or these are not the ones I've been looking for. But we are going to go take a look uh, over, see if we can find a UD, maybe even find another Rex. Uh, yeah, we're going to do that here just now. Uh, yeah, so it should be good. All right, uh, let's do that. Uh, these guys, uh, they're going to go on vacation as well. And then I'll probably talk about Scotland a little bit more while we're doing this. Just so you know. All right, because Scotland was amazing. All right. I do have to admit, there was a level right there. Um, I'm sorry, Mr. Baby Rex. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But I got a level from you, and that's what kind of was it. Hey, lucky for me, I found some sheep right here. Sorry, sheep. Continue doing your thing. I swear, I won't bug you anymore. I just want to eat one of you. It's fine. It's fine. All right, let's get over here. Oh, well, we're encumbered. And this stuff will probably spoil before I get up there. But you know what? It's fine, I guess. All right, but yeah, we're going up here to the caldera because I found out that that is, I mean, I've discovered that is like one of the best spots for Rexes and Uteranuses that I've seen. It's it's easy, they're everywhere, and with the um, way the spawn weight is on this map, the uh, spawns up there are actually re really good because uh, what I mean by spawn weight is what level they spawn in at, which is amazing. Plus also the amount of dinos that are up there, it's kind of impressive just how uh, much stuff you can get. Also, you can get um, owls down here. I mean, I've already got a pair of owls, a really good pair of owls. So uh, yeah, I don't think I need any of those. But I definitely want Uteranus and Rexes, most preferably Uteranus. And I probably should have checked to see what flavor my uh, Uteranus was uh, before I uh, came up here because I have forgotten whether it was male or female. But, you know, I'm fine with this. Let's see. Up up here. That, was that Allos? See if that was aloes. Yeah. Oh man, dude, guys, you guys can't be here, all right? I'm hunting for uteranuses, right? Yeah. Give me a sec. I just need stamina, all right? No, don't come bite me. I need stamina, all right? Hello. Let me stop. Take the break. Really? Give me a sec. Gosh. Jeez. Allos just need to learn how to cooperate, all right? Oh, there's a Rex down below. Let's see. 55. Never mind. All right, you're going to have to go. Let's see. Let's clear out some of this stuff. Whole bunch of stuff here. Oh wait, there's two rifles. Right. You're the oh, you're 90. Okay, never mind. You're both bad. Sorry. You are... 
Oh, you're just level 55. You're just eating all the locals. Oh, that's why you're healing up. Okay. Gotcha. Hold on, hold on. I gotta catch my breath. Thank you. Back over here. I'm not done with you. Oh. So that's a thing. Here, let me eat up all these guys. You ate another dude? Dude, what is... You are just a gullet, man. Thank you. Gosh, who would have thought I would have had this much trouble with the 55 Rex? Wow, okay, and now you are high. Thank you. All right, I think I found one. And apparently those as well. Oh, wait, wait, wait. oh hold on, hold on, hold on. Right, now this is like pretty close to good. Let's see. Okay, so there's go. Okay, you're down there. All right. All right, you're separated. All right, be separated and stay separated. What level are you? It honestly does twenty. Okay, that's fine. All right, but here, watch this. This one up here, we're gonna need to get. Can we put you up here? Thank you. You up here. Right. Eight. Yeah, that's a 145 female, which means that it's just almost exactly what we need. Right, so let's see. It's just so much easier to maneuver on a pilot. Where are you? You were over here, right? Yes, there you are. Right. Oh, wrong button. There you go. I'm gonna get a little bit of torpor on as soon as she starts to run. Actually, you know what? Come on. Thank you. Got my magnifying glass. No. I know I'm taking a little bit of time, but I don't want to be pelting her too hard and then let her run. I want her to chase me back up the cliff so I can uh, get her again. Because this is going to take a minute. That's a car. Oh, that's probably where her other car now went. Based in a Gallimimus, of course. I know you're not running. There you go. Oh, man. Okay. All right. Well, hey, chase me up the cliff. You're fine because you can't reapply that. And I'll be fine up here on the cliff because I can take a beating. As long as I don't go down through my corrupted territory, I'm fine. All right. And while this is going on, her torpor is going to be going. There we go. Thank you. Thank you. I just want to get close enough to where... Gets, uh, oh, when she uh, gets knocked out, it'll register. Okay. 
Come on. You got this. There you go. Time to take a nap. All right, sweet. Thank you, Green. All right, so now let's get Green back up here. Go grab the mana arm. There you go. Still up there on... Uh... That's not even Pride Rock. That's just on, just like... I don't know. Go up here, keep and watch on something. Anything good down there? Oh, there's more aloes. Okay. All right. Well, thank you, Green. Appreciate it. All right. You're going to have to go back inside your uh, thing. See how much time. I mean, it took me a minute uh, because I've been over here clearing out a bunch of stuff over here. And I think this is a fresh spawn. Uh, this Uteranus down here. But yeah, let's see. How much time do we have? Uh... Yeah, we, we, we're fine. I think. I mean, I, I can always go get more mutton. Um, I, if I need to, I can. Right, so hey, I'm going to be taming her, and I will see you guys in just a bit. All right, but yeah, anyway, uh, what I was talking about with Scotland is, uh, yeah, while I was over there, I mean, I'm just waiting on this uh, to tame up. She's doing fine. I mean, she's just taking a little nap right now. I pelted her pretty hard. All right, but um, yeah, so... I went to Glasgow a couple times. Uh, the train system over there. Oh, my God. I love the train system. This is, this is the second time I've been to Scotland. But every time I go, I always make sure I ride the train at least once or twice. Because it's just something that I don't get in my neck of the woods over here in the Pacific Northwest. And then, um, let's see. I uh, went to Glasgow. I love the architecture there. It's amazing. I went all around uh, there. And then... Uh, um, I stayed at a couple really cool places. Uh, one was really nice. Uh, it was like the spa country club uh, built in an old converted castle. It was really cool. Um, stayed there for a couple nights. And then uh, um, one of the days, uh, just packed up and then just drove uh, for probably about, uh, what was it? About three hours all around uh, in one direction. Uh, looking at a whole bunch of different locks because lo over in Scotland you can throw you can throw a stone and you'll hit a lock. I mean they're everywhere. And it's absolutely amazing and all of them are so cool and I love outdoorsy stuff. So I was just I, I was in heaven then and I even tweeted out a couple pictures uh, from uh, some of the locks. It's absolutely amazing. Then from there drove a, a, across the countryside past a, a couple uh, old abandoned castles that were out on the edges of locks and then uh, buy a couple castles that are still not abandoned. A uh, whole bunch of stuff like that. Went over through a whole bunch of different towns. And, I mean, over in Scotland, it's not like here in the States. Uh, when, here in the States, you can drive for two hours and, you know, not see anything. I mean, just go in one direction. I mean, you go past a couple towns and stuff like that. Over there, not the case. <laughs> not the case at all. Uh, you drive uh, five minutes, you're in a town. Another five minutes, you're in a town. Another ten minutes, you're in a town. And uh, especially if you take the back roads. And it is beautiful. It is amazing. Um, but yeah, lots of tight corners, lots of great roads. It, it, it's a great spot to be. And yeah, all right. So uh, yeah, that's... Uh, other than that, I did a whole bunch of other cool stuff, but yeah, I tweeted out uh, a bunch of stuff about the locks and everything. I loved it. It was great. Even a full a full size picture of me. So yeah. <laughs> All right, but yeah. Okay, I'm going to be waiting on this uh, girl. The episode's going to be running on wicked long if I just sit here talking about my trip to Scotland, which was amazing, by the way. But yeah. All right. So hey, I'll talk to you in just a bit. All right. Now here's the dilemma. Red drop there, purple drop on the other side of it. Purple drop over there. There was a purple drop of the ring over there, but I've already let that expire. There was another purple drop over there. And the UD's at 91%. Huh. What to... Right, well, I guess we can at least get this. And that was not worth it. All right, so lesson learned.
Come on. Come on. Okay. So many. Oh, that was one I didn't. That was one I didn't kill. Oh, and apparently. Okay. Anything else? Alpha Raptor. Oh, okay, we can do this. Ah, suck it, Alpha Raptor. And we got plenty of time left. All right. All right. And she's tamed. Let's see, let's get down here. And honestly, I mean, I'm going to take a look at her stats, but her stats really don't matter at this point. One. Come on. Come on. All right, can we get up here? Um, yeah. Oh, I think she has better... Can't get No, no. All right, we got it. We got to clip her leg. No, that's not the right clip. Let's see. No, no, no. Maybe I should just have her follow me up. No, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We got, we got this. I swear we got, we don't got this. We totally don't got this. All right, everybody, pay attention really quick as Flinger keeps falling off the side of a mountain and he repeats it over and over. This is not. Work. Sure, that works. All right. Yeah, come on. All right, so we have a female uterine... We have a female Uteranus. We have a male Uteranus. Uh, we've got a couple breedable Rexes. Uh, yeah, now all we need is a whole bunch of other stuff. Come on. All right, yeah, a whole bunch of other stuff. I mean, we haven't got Magnosaur eggs yet. I haven't got Wyvern. I mean, I've gotten a Wyvern egg. It wasn't very good, but I did get that. Uh, but yeah, I mean, now I'm back. Now I'm going to be uh, getting resuming... Uh, Oh, uh, the, uh, five days a week content that I've been doing for years, which I love doing. It is absolutely amazing. Why are you so encumbered? Really? That much meat? There we go. Yay, now we can actually move and do things. All right, but yeah, I'm going to get back to base. I'm going to unload uh, these guys, and I will see you guys uh, in the next video. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed uh, today's video. If you haven't already, make sure you click that like button. I really appreciate it. It really helps me out. And until next time, this is Flicker Foo, nose diving into the swamp, and take it easy, everybody.